Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. So today's video is going to be, as you can tell from the title, a spring haul. Um, I have a few clothing items and a few makeup items that I wanted to share with you guys since the spring is literally around the corner. The snow finally melted, it's starting to look better out, the rain's come down, all that nasty spring wetness and gooeyness and muddiness is coming. So yeah, I'm super excited to show you guys everything that I got. All the clothing pieces that I got, I will not be trying on unfortunately because they're more for after I give birth, so it doesn't really fit me right now, but they will hopefully fit me after I give birth. So I'll just kind of show like a little cart, like a little picture on the screen of what it looks like on the website and on the model and everything. So that'll give you guys an idea of what the clothing pieces looks like. Try it on! Without further ado, let's jump right into this haul. Alright, so I only have a few makeup items to include in this video, so I'm just gonna kind of get them out of the way. So the first place is from Sephora, and I just got a few little things from there. So this right here is the um, Patrick Ta um, body oil, and I have it in the shade A Vision, and this guy looks so stunning, so gorgeous. I cannot wait to try it. This is what it looks like in the bottle. It's just like a really really pretty um kind of like a rose gold kind of color and yeah it's so gorgeous i've never tried this before and i'm super excited so you just kind of spray it on your body and flip it in oh it's gonna it's so gorgeous like i've been loving really um what is it oh it smells good too i've been loving more of like the glowy dewy kind of look so this is perfect it's so it smells really really good but yeah um, I just got the little one I didn't get a full-size one because I know that I will never go through a full bottle of this because the full bottle is humongo so I just got the smaller one and I know that this is gonna last me forever so I'm super excited to put this guy to use and also from Sephora I got like these two duo little things they kind of go together and I'm super excited to try this because the all the moisturizers I've been using lately I'm not a huge fan of um, I always just go back to my it cosmetics confidence in a cream like that's my go-to ride or die I got these two to test out to see if I like them I already know that I like the Clinique regular dramatically different uh, moisturizer but this one is a little bit different it has like a little cartridge that you put inside of it and then it does like its own little thing so the first step is the moisturizing lotion and this is what the bottle looks like and then the second step they have like a few different ones i'll kind of put a picture on the screen to show you guys like all the different ones that they have but it's like a little cartridge that you put in it and it comes with a pump as well which is really convenient and the cartridge that i got is the uneven skin tone because my skin i'm like darker on my forehead i have rosy cheeks and i'm really really pale right here like my skin is just very uneven so i got the uneven one to put inside of it to use and i'm so excited to try this i'm gonna put this to use like right away i don't even know how to do this let's do this together you take the little plastic thing off oh just like that okay and then hold on i need to read this you put it inside you twist it and that's it so you just kind of put it in twist it on and then you start pumping it so cool okay i'm super excited for this this is awesome so i will actually keep you guys updated on this um maybe i'll do start doing like favorites videos like i used to in the past and let you guys know how i feel about this let me know if you guys want to see like a monthly favorites video i will definitely do that so moving along that is everything i got from sephora and then i went to ulta as well and i just got a few new palettes from ulta um, well, new palettes for me, but these are more like they've been in the game for a really long time So the first palette I have here, they're all three all three of them are by Juvia's Place or Julia's Palace or something like this um, I think it's Juvia's Just Juvia's that's what it says in all of them But the first one I have here is the warrior. This is the second one by Juvia's and 
This one is inspired by the Amazons. Oh, it says inspired by the ferocious and decapitating beauty of the Dahomey Amazons of Africa, who defied a societal, <laughs> I cannot read, who defied a societal norms to protect their people, a true embodiment of strength, fierceness, and beauty. The warrior palette consists of nine highly pigmented shades, and this is what the palette looks like. It is just gorgeous. I've never tried anything from this brand before, so I really want to do like a first impressions review on one of these palettes. So let me know down in the comments which palette you guys would like to see like a first impressions review on. This is what the Warriors 2 palette looks like. It is super duper gorgeous. Um, it comes with nine shades and oh my god, it's so pretty. It's just like a perfect everyday neutral um, eyeshadow palette. So if like you're traveling or something, you could just kind of throw this in your makeup bag and you have all the shades you need to create just like an everyday kind of makeup look. But it's so gorgeous. This is more of like a warm toned palette and i love it it's so pretty oh my gosh palette number two is the zulus and i'm super excited for this one i forgot like what it looks like and everything on the back up here it says artist life the ambience of the zulu palette takes on a new character it exemplifies the rich arts of the ndabale people of south africa um embodied with colorful symmetry and precision a limitless expression of self through eccentric hues Earth tones and exotic metallic shades. Okay, this one's cute. This one's very, very, very vibrant, very colorful. I love it. I love how um the top part right here is kind of like holographic. I'm not sure if you guys can really see that on camera or not, but these colors are gorgeous. This green one right here in the middle. Oh my god. Okay. I'm super excited for this palette. I love playing with colors. Um, I know that I don't really wear a lot of makeup when I'm making videos. But if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys will see that I do some more colorful, more playful looks on Instagram. So yeah, I'm super excited for this palette. This might be one of my favorites so far. Last makeup item in this haul is the Nubian by um, Juvia's. And this is just one of their like main eyeshadow palettes, I believe. Like a lot of people have tried these. Um, there's no like nothing on the back of this one like how the, Ju the other ones have. Like they have like a little explanation of like what each palette is inspired by but this one doesn't but this one looks like an egyptian one i love it it's so cute i love their aesthetic it's so unique and different all right so this is the nubian palette and instead of a nine pan this is actually a 12 pan palette and it just comes with all different colors of neutrals and there's some shimmers there's some mattes it's really really nice and pretty and neutral um, it's a little bit different from the Warrior 2 one. I feel like the Warrior 2 one is a little bit more like warm tone while this one's more cool toned. And you can definitely create different looks on both of these. And the Warrior 2 is all matte shadows while this one incorporates some, um, sorry if you hear my kids screaming in the back, but the Ju, not the Juvia, but the Nubian one has a little bit more of shimmer in it. so. Super excited. I cannot wait to put these palettes to the test. Now moving along to what you guys are all probably looking forward to is all my clothing pieces. Aside from all makeup related things, beauty related things, um, subscription boxes, I absolutely love, love, love fashion. So I cannot wait to show you guys all the pieces that I got. So I actually placed a huge order on the website Boohoo. If you don't know what Boohoo is, it is a online website and they are originally from the UK, but shipping is very, very fast. I wanna say I got my package to me in less than a week. If not, it was a week, but it got here very, very fast. And I really love Boohoo. I usually get clothes from Boohoo all the time. But yeah, they usually have sales going on, so make sure to check out their website every now and then, and you will catch some good deals on their clothes. So the first thing here is a pair of high-rise distressed skinny jeans, and these are a dark blue wash. They're super, super cute. I cannot wait to wear these once I give birth. But um, it says here it's a US size 2, a UK size 6. So this will fit me perfectly. I like going up a size when I'm wearing high-waisted 
jeans just because I got a little tummy fat from giving birth to four kids. The next item I have here is another pair of jeans and these are in an actual size. These are actually a size four, so that is a US size zero. And they're just these um, kind of distressed skinny jeans as well. And they're kind of hemmed on the bottom right here. And these again are high waisted and I feel like these ones will make my butt like really, really good. And I believe this one is a petite one. Yep, so this one's called the Petite Distressed Hem Skinny Jeans. And I am a petite, but sometimes I don't get petite clothes just because I can kind of pull off either one. This next clothing item here is actually a two-piece, and it's called the Bandeau Pinstripe Trouser. And I got it in a size 6, so that is a US size 2. And this is what the top looks like. It's super cute, so it's just like a little spaghetti strap, and it's cropped. And then here are the bottoms. The bottoms are very, very plain, very simple, high-waisted trousers. And I just feel like this is a really cute, like, kind of business casual kind of outfit. Then here is another two-piece set. This is called the Oversized T-Shirt and Cycling Shorts. And this is like a lilac color. And I got it in a size 8 just because it's oversized and I want it to stay over, like, be super oversized. This is more like just an outfit for me to lounge around the house. Or like just when I need to go and do errands but this is the shirt so it is like kind of like the rib texture and the uh, material in it it feels kind of like polyester so it's like this really really nice stretchy soft fabric material and I really really like the color but it's super super cute perfect for spring and then the shorts that come with it look like this and I know that these are gonna be a little bit big on me but that's fine because I more so am gonna use these for um, lounging around the house and then I actually would rather pair this with like a pair of black ones or something like that then this next one right here um, I don't know what this one is let's see oh okay this is cute so this is actually a bodysuit it's just a black bodysuit with like this little lacy satin puff on the sleeves or whatever you want to call it so this is called the organza sleeve scoop back bodysuit and yeah it's super super cute i cannot wait to wear this oh my gosh i love it it's so adorable this would be perfect to pair with like just a pair of jeans or like a pair of shorts in the summer or something like that like high-waisted shorts super cute you can even pair this with like a nice little leather black skirt oh that would be adorable but yeah this is so cute i cannot wait and then the back it kind of scoops down a little bit lower i'm not sure if the camera is picking it up but super cute cannot wait to try this and i got this one in a size six this next clothing item here is the satin stripe collarless shirt in a size eight now i got a size eight just because i wanted it to be a little bit more oversized and not form fitted but this is what it looks like it's just like this really pretty it kind of reminds me of like coffee color um but it is mocha it says that it's like a mocha color on here but yeah this is what it looks like it's just a sheer satin kind of button up shirt yeah super cute i can actually wear this now if i wanted to just because it's like a little bit oversized and this last item here is another pair of jeans so these are the petite frayed hem skinny jeans and these are black jeans so i actually don't own any pairs of black jeans um i have one pair but that one's way too small on me now but this is what this one looks like it's just plain black and then it's hemmed on the bottom right here like there's no distressing on it and this is just perfect because i just wanted a pair of jeans that would just not have anything that i could wear to anywhere but yeah these are just some nice black plain jeans and i got these ones in a size six and that is a us two okay guys so that is everything that i have for today's video um i hope you guys enjoyed if you guys want to see more hauls i would definitely do that for you guys and i will see you guys in my next video maybe it might be my giveaway maybe not but yeah, I love you guys and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!